Hello everyone, this is Dominic, or Chad if you're, whichever you prefer, and I figure I should probably let all of you watching through YouTube know what's been going on with me for the last little while. Because I haven't been here very much, but I have been around. I have been doing stuff, and I figure I should probably let you know what is going on. So, the bad news for most of you is that I haven't really done a lot of Zero K in a while. As you may have noticed, this is something I was doing, I've been doing since 2013. I've been doing it for almost nine years now. But, or eight years, because I haven't done all year. And I imagine some of you are wondering what's going on. And the answer is that, unfortunately, I've kind of burnt out on Zero K. In fact, I kind of burnt out a long time ago. I enjoyed watching the game well enough, but I hadn't been playing it for a while. And honestly, it doesn't feel right to keep casting it like that and also even commentating it it was it's fine i just you know there's other people streaming it like i i wanted to be there to help build up a scene and the scene has built up uh, that's that's what i wanted that's what i got so i'm pretty satisfied and at this point i've been kind of shifting around to other things and i figure I might as well let you know what's going on so the first and i suppose primary thing in terms of how much I'm doing them is that I have been doing some tournaments in the last few months for Guilty Gear Strive and also for Guilty Gear Plus R. And both of these tournaments have been, or tournament series, have been at the NCA FGC Twitch channel, not my own Twitch channel. So if you've been watching my Twitch channel not a lot's been going on there in terms of fighting games because not a lot has been going on there in terms of fighting games. It's just not been on that channel. So I'll put a link in the description to the NCA FGC Twitch channel because every Tuesday at 5.30 Pacific and Thursday at 5.30 Pacific, I do Strive and Plus R respectively. Guilty Gear Strive and Guilty Gear Accent Core Plus R because those are the tournaments. Please come and join us. I know it's a change of pace from Zero K okay and from strategy games in general, but it is also a kind of game I really enjoy. And I think it captures a lot of the same overall gameplay dynamics that you get from strategy games, just in a much more compact package. The other bit of news that's more relevant to the YouTube channel directly is that I am also doing tournaments for an upcoming strategy game called Immortal Gates of Pyre. And you may have seen this already if you have been watching my Twitch channel because I have been commentating tournaments on it. I have been doing a lot of the official tournaments. There were some community tournaments while the official tournaments were on hiatus. This has also been something I've been doing for several months and it is probably going to be the main game on YouTube going forward. I have not decided if I want to start throwing fighting game stuff up here too, but the immortal stuff is something I'm planning on putting on here. There have been technical difficulties with the tournaments that I have not wanted to put on YouTube because I didn't think they put the best foot forward, but I will be ideally putting some tournament footage on YouTube starting next week. So YouTube will start updating again, but it will be a different game. It will still be a strategy game, but it will be a different style of game. It's a bit more of a StarCraft style strategy game rather than a Total Annihilation or Supreme Commander style strategy game. It's not like StarCraft in the sense that it's super mechanically intense and you have to be going at 300 APM to play the game at all. It definitely is designed to avoid that, but it is still the kind of game where you are building up resources in chunks and spending them in chunks and it's focused a lot on more discrete bases rather than spread out expansions as zero k does so it's not going to be the same dynamic play wise but it is still coming with the same approach to accessibility and the same approach to same approach to having a relatively low skill floor and relatively high skill ceiling that zero k had so it's a different baseline but the same philosophy and i do really like that it's been something i've been looking forward to for a while it the that style of game, StarCraft, but with the same philosophy that Zero K applied to Total Annihilation, but applied to StarCraft, is the kind of game I've been looking for since StarCraft 2 was announced. That's why I, I am pretty excited about this. So please stay tuned. I understand if you are very disappointed that there's very likely not going to be more Zero K content. 
Kingstad has taken over the 0k streaming for tournaments, as far as I'm aware. I will also link their channel in the description as well. So if you are only interested in 0k stuff, please go watch them and the other people who have been streaming 0k over the last few months, because they're the ones who are picking up the torch. As for me, if you are wanting to watch fighting game stuff, again, the NCA FGC channel is the primary place I do the tournaments for. And if you're interested in Immortal, this upcoming game, or Immortal Gates of Pyre is the full title, this upcoming game that I have been doing various tournaments for, as well as the occasional stream of myself playing, then stay tuned, because that is what I'm planning to put on the channel this, for the time being. Anyway, thank you all for watching, and thank you for being with me for as long as you have. However long you've been here, I really appreciate it. And as always, have a good night, everyone.